What's up, everybody? Welcome to Musty Yeti's Tactical HQ. Well, uh, if you guys remember a few videos back, I mentioned that there was a little bit of play between the upper and the lower. Let's see if you can hear that. Oh. So a little bit of play. Um, I wasn't too worried about it, but like I told somebody in the comment box below in that video that I went out and went shooting. There were five other ARs, including my Bushmaster, and I looked at all of them, and they all had the same amount of play. So there really isn't any concern here. Someone in the comment box did say it was a Seekins Precision Lower and not the Mega Arms Upper. Um, it looks like it doesn't really matter who is at fault here. Uh, there is play. There's play in most rifles and it really shouldn't affect the accuracy at all. But while I was ordering some other parts for my AR-15, uh, more specifically the rail covers for the NSR, I figured I'd try to find a place that had the rail covers and also had a little, a little doohickey to fix my problem. So I started looking around and I found out that my buddies over at, let me see where I got this from again, at DSG Arms had the rail covers and also the piece that's supposed to go in here and help tighten down the, the slack between the upper and lower. So let's just go ahead and get this thing open and we'll show you what I got. So hopefully it's going to be as simple as it looks. To be honest, I can't remember the name of the product I bought. Okay, so first off, here are the Noveski rail covers, and here is that little piece I was talking about. This thing is called the Accu Wedge uh, Clean Bore AR15 M16 Accessory Accu Wedge. So like it shows in the, well, is it blurry? I can't tell. I don't know. Anyway, I hope you guys can see it. But like it shows in the picture, you pretty much uh, pop out your takedown pin here. Get this knife out of the way before I cut myself. Uh, you pop out the takedown pin, and the Accu Wedge drops in and provides a little bit of resistance between the two, and hopefully stops the slack. Accu Wedge eliminates. <clears throat> let's see what it says here. The Accu Wedge eliminates play between receivers for more solid feel to improve accuracy. Accu Wedge buffers cycling system to reduce wear on impact surfaces. No modifications required. Easy installation. Drop an Accu Wedge in rear of all receiver as shown. Close upper receiver squeeze and pinch in place. So let's go ahead and give this thing a shot and see how well it works. Probably doesn't work at all, but this thing was like, I don't know, four, bu four bucks. So I figured if I'm paying, you know, 40 bucks for the uh, rail covers, I might as well spend a four extra dollars and see if this thing actually does anything. So hopefully I do this without too many issues. Let's take out the magazine. And guys, we're definitely safe here. Uh, a, it's on safe. B, there's no bolt carrier group and charging handle still. So we're good there. What we're going to do is just pop out our takedown pin, open this thing up. And the way this is supposed to work is take your Accu Wedge stick it down inside of your receiver there like so you can see and close it ooh man I might not even be able to get this thing closed oh yeah well oh let me get it off camera hold on alright guys so I got it off camera I just had to give it some force from the top it closed down and uh, it definitely has absolutely zero play in it. So I don't know if that was really worth it. Like I said, it was only four or five bucks. But um, if you guys have the problem of play like I do and you want to just try to fix it, AccuWidge is a nice cheap product. The only downside I've heard from looking at uh, reading reviews and looking at stuff on YouTube is you can't just pop these out anymore by hand. You'll have to take a a bullet or a screw, something, an Allen wrench, and just pop it from the other side to get it out. So, no more doing it by hand. Uh, let me see if I can do it by hand. Let me take it off camera. I'm going to just do the opposite way before. I'm going to press down. All right, so there you go. I definitely did it without any tools of any kind. I just had to uh, copy what I did before and press down. Here, let's, do, let's do it right here. So, press. There, we're in. So, Accu Wedge is installed, and it actually does what it says. It eliminates the play between the two. So, there's an option for you guys. Now let's just go back to these. Um, so, these are the NSR uh, key mod rail covers for the, obviously, the NSR rail. Um, I have heard 
good and bad things about these rail covers. I've heard people say that they a, are really hard to get on, which is a good thing you don't want them popping off. But on the flip side, I've heard people say that they fall off when they're shooting. And when I hear that, I immediately think that the person that installed those ones didn't do it properly or they didn't have it all the way seated into the key mod slot and it just worked its way out. Because you can't have it both ways in my eyes. It can't be, you know, impossible to get in and then just have it flop out when you're shooting. So, we'll see how that goes. I got two packages because I don't think there's enough in one to get the job done of covering the whole rail. I don't think there's a receipt. Oh, what is this? Oh, holy shit. This was in my box. I didn't see it before. 2013 Unfair Advantage. And it looks like it is a Magpul poster that I didn't even buy any Magpul parts. Oh, this is the poster I already have. Let's see. So it's something a little bit different. It's just a, a poster showing all the parts they have. So they probably just had a buttload of those things floating around and they just thought they'd throw it in there. It's probably a form of junk mail. But um, I don't have a receipt in the box, so I can't remember what I paid for these. I think they were like 12 or 13 bucks a piece. Either way, there wasn't enough in one to do the whole rail. I'm not even sure there's going to be enough in two to do the whole rail. Well, not before my hands go anyway. But we'll see. Yeah, that's about it, guys. Uh, I guess the most important thing is that the AccuWedge actually does what it's supposed to do, which is good to see. It's a nice change of pace. So that's it, guys. If you have any questions on the rail covers or the AccuWedge, leave in the comment box below. As usual, guys, take care, stay safe, and we'll see you next time.